let's look at this uh, app right here. Okay. All right, so now he's gonna show us the app. Okay. So this is the current status. Right. Um, now I gotta uh, go a little closer so people can see that. You see that time seven, play the lottery, <laughs> I'm telling you. Hey, look at it, it says 72%. There's too many sevens going on around here, but okay, all right. <laughs> Consumption is normally, and I'll do the power flow. Yeah, here we it's go. usually about 1.2. Right. Right now, um, you know, a couple things are on. Yeah. Usually about 1.2. But if yeah. I can get 30 mm -hmm. from a, the entire day, 30, 35, right. in one full sunny day, I could actually dump all of that to about 90, 95 percent, mm -hmm. the excess will be going back into the grid. And that's my, but as yeah. soon as night comes, right. obviously no panels, right. then I will source all the the power, that the energy that to the, the consumption, but exactly. we're not consuming that much. Right, right. So the very next day, that excess will go into the grid. Okay. So what utility companies here in um, BG and E? Is it a, a co-op or no? So can you sell back? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, well, the answer is ultimately yes. Mm -hmm. But how it will work is is um, over time through net meterings program. They give you a credit. They're going to give us credits. Yeah, okay? Right. okay. They're yeah. going to get us credits, and if we want to cash out on those credits at the end of the yearly cycle. Mm -hmm. In April, they would just cut us a check. Right. So, wow, yeah. I tell you, man, what, what and that's the, that's a cool app. I love that app on the phone. That app, mm -hmm. I mean, I look at it quite a bit. Now, how many times have you looked at that app since you? 7,000. <laughs> I know that's right. I know that's another seven. I know that's another seven. <laughs> Seven thousand. Yeah, it, it is a really cool looking app when you have it. You just flip it out like, oh, hmm, yeah, I'm off the grid. Oh, yeah, this is happening. Yeah, this is yeah. very cool. All right, so uh, this is, um, uh, again, thank you for the invite. Uh, we're going to talk about this Tesla, uh, which is a very unique car. This guy is just knocking it out the park. What, what do your friends call you? What's that nickname that you said? <laughs> Leon Musk. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so as if that wasn't enough with these seven power walls. Yeah. <laughs> and I think he was telling me this is like the 1,000th Tesla that was ever yeah, made. Yeah, so first it's not the thousand. exact 1,000th, but it's it's very close to that. Okay. So this is the one of the 1,000th one ever made. Jesus. Okay. So this is the first gen of the first gens. They used to... Um, not badge them. This is the original Dolphin Gray. Okay, okay. so um, they don't make this gray anymore. Yeah. The newer gray is a little bit darker. Midnight gray or whatever. Yeah, it's, it's, a, it's a little yeah. bit darker. It's yeah. very nice. Right, right. You also got the new MCU two, right? Is that? Is yeah, that I do have about? the new MCU two. Right. Yeah. Right, right, um, right. So these are the original seats. So that's how they originally yeah, came. Yeah. These are the performance seats. Right. But um, but yeah, and um, it's got the carbon fiber in here too as well. Yeah, yeah. yeah, this yeah. is the yacht floor. Oh my God, I had that at one point. I forgot about that. Yeah, yeah I, my car's 2015, and I had the yacht floor, and I used to like it. The rims match the color of the car, so oh. the dolphin gray on the um the rims match the the original wow. dolphin gray. Wow. So this. Uh, At any point, do you think you're going to stay here for the rest of your life? Now, the reason why I ask that, because I, in my late 50s, decided to get the power wall. Okay. And I have, and I got the solar panels. Okay. And I was hoping, like in the back of my mind, maybe my son would take over the house, right? Okay. And, or my daughter, or whatever. And that's totally up to them when I'm gone. But it has been in the back of my mind. My wife says, we're getting older. We can't be walking up a lot of stairs. I'm like, yeah, but I ain't there yet. So has it ever crossed your mind or your wife's mind that you might not be here and you, you got these seven power walls in here and a cyber truck or two and a Tesla? <laughs> I mean, you can't be carting that off to the old folks home. <laughs> no, but, but um, the answer is, because I've, I've been asked that before, right. when we get the second house, the third house, that yeah. we're going to get 10 power walls. For the next house. Of course. So it's just, it just that's the way. And I put panels, as sexy these panels look, I'm getting the panel of the solar roof. 
okay. on the single family house, okay. we're gonna get the roof. So you know you're gonna make your money and, and then some if you ever sell this because of the fact that it's upgraded. Oh, oh yeah, this, you know? this puts this puts a lot of money right. in the value right, of the house right, immediately. Right, right, right. Yeah, right. yeah that's, wow. it's, not a, it's not a game. So if y'all missed the previous episodes, uh, I'm in Leon's garage and he's in a town home. We were just talking about his awesome Tesla that's original back in 2012, right? Yes. So now he has seven Powerballs. So you might have to backtrack and check out <laughs> the previous episodes if you just happen to find this one. This man right here has the most Powerballs in a residential home yes. in the United States, possibly in the world. It's just, I cannot uh, tell you how much I love Tesla. I ordered and I reserved two Model 3s on the day of the announcement. So when Elon was, was talking, I ordered that night. Right. But I am a big guy and um, I rode in the Model 3s. The Model 3 is phenomenal. Right. Yeah, I mean, it's just a, it is phenomenal of a car, but specifically for the air suspension. Yes. There's a difference. Right. And so I felt everything in the road with a Model 3. Right. And so that was one thing that I was like, okay, it might not be for me. Right. But, um, but second thing is that because I'm such a big guy, the, me, the, uh, the Model Y was gonna come out as well. Mm -hmm. And so the Model Y is a perfect setup. Right. So if the S is a little bit too large for you, or the Model 3 is a little too small for you, the Model Y is ridiculous. So, well, Leon, this has been an amazing, I, I swear, I'm truly honored that you invited me here. Okay. And uh, we talked on the phone, we hit it right off, and you showed me these seven power walls. I wish Rosie was here. <laughs> oh, yeah, man. I, I mean, I Rosie, this video, man. I was Rosie, so pumped. Rosie I was inspired, be man. I was inspired yeah, yeah, by, yeah. Uh, by, I mean, he was, you said the third in the state right but the first in charles, in charles county, county yeah. yeah rosie is yeah. for those who don't know he has the first he has the solar roof and uh since then yeah. there's a few people in near around my community that has the solar roof as well but anyway uh thank you again for uh inviting me here this is so awesome you have an it's awesome so car awesome. and you have like your energy sustainability with all the bikes and power walls and teslas and cyber trucks oh, man man it's, it's, it's all in all right man thank you so much you're welcome